Good morning. Today we are looking at conditions, or good afternoon rather, we're looking at conditions that are uh, similar to this morning's weather. We have the wind picking up here today and turning northerly, and our flags are blowing in a different direction now at the Dakota Magic Casino as a result of that cold front moving through. You can see that they're moving pretty uh, uh, quite a bit here with that wind uh, picking up here for us for today. Mostly cloudy skies in some areas getting some rain or maybe even a flake or two here and heading into the afternoon. So so we've cooled down significantly in the wake of the front. Fargo was in the 40s this morning, and now we're at 33 degrees. It's 31 in Grand Forks and in Thief River Falls, 32. So some of us even below freezing or at freezing. Raining being, rain being reported in Bemidji, we're at 36 degrees. And look how warm we are in Fergus Falls ahead of the front still, 48 degrees. Devil's Lake has been below freezing for some time at 30. Here's a look at those winds coming in out of the north behind that front. We're starting to see it move through in Fergus Falls and Wadena, and uh, you'll get that northerly breeze and some colder air taking over for you. We're going to see temperatures uh, dipping there, and then some of us will try to rise with that sunshine uh, trying to warm us up today in a couple of pockets where we clear out. But overall, it says north wind that will keep that cooler air driving in. Here's a look at our radar right now. Fargo Moorhead kind of looking to the east now for precipitation down into the Barnesville area, back down into Wapiton Breckenridge. There may be a couple of sprinkles in the Wheaton area and back over toward uh, Detroit Lakes and Park Rapids. Uh, that region seeing some of those showers yet again. So the focus is more on Lakes Country for the showers along the front. Behind it, there's another area here up into the northern part of the Red River Valley where we've got the potential for a line of snow showers. Let's zoom in on that area. Uh, you can see I'm going to pause our view and you can see that we're looking at uh, some blue on the map indicating that we've got some snow stretching from Cavalier to Langdon and back down uh, through Devil's Lake. Looks like flurry activity at this point, but still uh, something to watch out for today. And don't be surprised if you see a flake roll through. Here's a look at our hour by hour planner. Expect temperatures to struggle heading into the afternoon. You can see we're going to be into the 30s and 40s. Notice how there are some areas where we get a few breaks in the clouds, especially in the northwest where we clear out a little bit more and in addition we still have that potential for a few of those flakes to affect us northern valley and east would be the focus for that as the front continues to move on by six o'clock most of us done with the precipitation though there may still be some in our eastern counties and then heading into tonight really clearing out into the nighttime hours where we're looking at temperatures Overnight dipping quite a bit into the 20s, maybe some of us along the international border down into the teens to start off your Saturday. But notice how the clouds are gone. And so is the precipitation. We're uh, moving that on and we're going to start the day with clear skies. And that'll lead to a sunny Saturday. Here's a look at Saturday's forecast. Expect temperatures to be a cooler yet again. We're looking at some 40s, maybe a couple of places hitting that 50 degree mark, especially because we have some late April sunshine. It's stronger this time of year. And that may just help to push some of us over the top in the low 50s tomorrow, but most places spending the afternoon in the 40s. Uh, so looking better for Saturday as far as sky cover is concerned, but a little bit cool here. Once again, running below average, which is in the low 60s for this time of year. And to Sunday, another system approaches. This one moving in from the southwest. It's going to bring in some chances for rain and snow on Sunday. We'll warm up with it eventually, uh, but that just brings thunderstorm chances for Monday. So some active weather coming coming up with the break tomorrow. It's like every other day the sun is appearing and then it's going away. So we'll have to definitely stay tuned and just dress for the weather. Thanks, Lisa. Straight, straight ahead at noon, a stunning sight in the Florida this morning as the SpaceX rocket takes astronauts to the International Space Station. 